Coach Petrie, um, heading into this season, what are you most looking forward to? You know, I'm just so excited to play in front of the fans. You know, last year at all levels, it just the COVID um, restrictions, they presented so many just hurdles that everybody had to navigate through. And um, our team style's norm, style of play is very, very fast. And so, um, you know, we, we feed off a of crowd energy and um, we're just looking forward to getting back in front of those guys. Always good to have to have fans around. Um, what is it looking at your team? What do you like most about your team this year? Um, you know, I, I try to always look at things and spin them a, a negative into a positive. And so I, I took the job. Um, I believe I was hired on June the 8th and we had two healthy players and two players that we were absolutely sure were eligible in terms of transfer and things like that. And so um, I was a, I was happy that I was able to come in and create the culture that I wanted rather than try to come in and change things. And so um, I, I, I'm happy that we, we have all these new bodies and everybody's got a fresh start. We, you know, we, we hit the transfer portal hard. Um, it's a fresh start. People, um, seem to have a lot of pep in their step and just high energy, um, excited to do new things. Uh, looking again at your team, what is one important thing that must happen for you all to be successful this year? Um, I think we all need to just continue to try to jail. You know, that is a, a challenge, you know, personally, um, everything is great off the court, but, not having those third, fourth year, fifth year players, you know, like we're playing against teams in the league that have had people that have played together. This is their, you know, fourth or fifth year. So that'll, that'll be definitely a challenge for us. And so we've got to continue to develop um, just our, our, our consistency and in how we're going to play the flow of our offense um, and just that overall team chemistry. Yeah, you talk about the gelling potentially being a challenge. Do you view that as the biggest challenge for you all this upcoming season, or is there something else that's sort of sitting in the back of your head? Um, I, I believe, like, like specifically to the basketball court, um, we're gonna have, we're gonna. I mean, you're always gonna have to make shots, but um, we are, I would say, more athletic than we are. Just you know that you you put people. Everybody's got to have a little bit of skill and a little bit of athleticism to be a great player. But um, I think we would lean, you know, more towards the the athletic side. You know, we're we're we're, we're going to have the ability to run and jump and defend and do things like that. But um, with that, um, we're my, one of my concerns is that we need to shoot the basketball from the perimeter um, a, a lot better than we currently are. And so um, the girls are spending time on their own, 500 shots a day, 500 makes a day. They're, they're, they're trying to get that. Um, that's how you come a, become a great shooter is to spend the time. And so um, hopefully by, you know, January, February, March, you know, we'll have those reps in and our percentage will be where it needs to be. Gotcha. I gotcha. Um, switching gears here a little bit. What are your general impressions on the OVC as a whole uh, for the 21, uh, 22 season? You know, I, I think it's, um, you know, Belmont's obviously Belmont. They're, they're extremely good. I, when I took the job, um, I made it a priority to um, come in and study each team. I, I kind of, you know, we had a, we had a Murray week, we had a SEMO week, you know, where me and my staff were, um, you know, preparing like we were about to play them. I thought it was very important that I familiar, familiarize myself with the league, with the coaching style, with the players. And I mean, it's a good league. I mean, there's, there's, it's a very high skill level league. Um, it's well coached. There's disciplined basketball um, seems to have a lot of shooters and um, I, I'm, I'm just excited to be a part of it. I have a, a lot of respect um, for all the coaches, you know, I've had relationships with, the majority of them in the past, um, you know, I was at the junior college level most recently. And so um, we've developed friendships and, um, you know, partnerships in, in recruiting. And so happy, happy to be on the flip side of that and competing against them.